Yes. What? What? <laughs> This guy got Gatorade Zero. Of course, it was on zero set. sugar. This guy buys zero sugar Gatorade. You're dumb. <laughs> hey guys, welcome to this episode of Matt with Fishing Adventures. We are heading out on our trip that we look forward to every single year. We are heading out west in search of some tiger trout. I got my two main boys with me, Tyler. Say hi to the camera crew. I got all the red gator. All, all yours, all yours. Other buddy here, Colton, you guys have seen these faces before. This is an annual trip, third trip to be exact. We got the boat all packed up. We got the truck packed up, got some firewood. Gonna have a great time. We're out for three days. Today is Thursday night and we're coming back Sunday. Tiger Trout's the plan. If it goes really well the first couple of days, you might try another lake, but other than that, it's just tigers, tiger, tigers. 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 <laughs> Tigers. If you're new here, just click that subscribe button for me. Turn on the bell notifications. It's gonna be a great video. I'm excited. There's no wind. Let's go. Good morning everyone, welcome to the Trout Excursion Team. We made out here safely last night like 12 o'clock, set up base camp and today, well it's like minus one right now, it's pretty freaking chilly. Uh, very very windy overnight, it looks like it's died down a bit, but how are we feeling boys? First few casting, feeling good? Feeling good, good yeah, feeling good. Sure. Got high yeah. hopes. There will definitely be a fish caught in about a half. Oh for sure, for sure. So uh, we're using a couple little spoons little crankbaits and uh, little tube jigs. So uh, I'm gonna get tied up, set some things up, and then uh, get off fishing. So stay tuned, and once again, make sure you subscribed. Okay, net is accessible. Net is accessible. Okay, I'm starting off with this little uh, 16 ounce tube jig and a slip bobber, four feet, gonna cast in this bull rushes and uh, see if we can get it done. Oh, that's light. That is light. I hate wind with the passion. All right, Tyler's hooked up. Oh, it's off. Oh! Oh, I did too. Did you tie your knot properly? Oh my god, is that on the swivel I gave you too? Yeah. That's good then. That that doesn't sound good. That reel sounds like it's frozen. My I, oh my gosh. We're gonna slam so, <gasps> As we're getting stuff ready to tie up <laughs> Tyler again. Get it. Not huge. Nice one. Yeah, first fish we said half an hour. Let's go. There I'm we gonna, go. I'm gonna tell you, man, that one that I had was <laughs> massive. Man, your, your art was bending. That's awesome, nice, dude. boys, all right. Okay, I'm trying to get these two hooks untangled. Here, I'll, uh, you wanna get it? What a cluster. This I'll is great for spot lock. Hey? Yeah. So right as Tyler got bit and lost a giant, not even 30 seconds later, Colton hooks into the first one of the trip and it's the first one successfully netted. Okay. Nothing huge, but uh, very nice colors on it. Let's see if we can see if Colton can get her done. He's been practicing. Whoa. Nice. Cool fish, man. Yeah, it looks good. Yeah, man. Nice awesome. colors. Not bad size. No, not at all. All right. Okay. Ready for the release? Yes, sir. Saucer back. It's actually, uh, it's actually pretty small. We're looking for a lot bigger. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, nice, 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 nice. Oh, I see all the way out there. Nice one. Yeah, that's a nice one. Heck yeah. Fish on. Woo wee. Okay. Good job, buddy. I'm going to stand behind you guys. Ooh, look at it. That's a big one, eh? 
Oh yeah, Here, I'm gonna go around to this side, Tyler. Oh yeah, dude, that's a nice, that's a big fish. That's a big fish. I don't know if it's that big, actually. Oh my god, why are you getting on the same side <laughs> as everybody else? Like, <laughs> I can't tell. I don't think it is that big. Dude, it's nice. That is docile, though, eh? Yeah. You didn't even kill Oh, it's a male, it's a male. Nice. Oh yeah, buddy. Yeah, leave in the water, leave in the water, leave in the water. Awesome. Hey. Yeah, me. Yeah, bro. Oh, first no. masters. Awesome. Nice. That's a wicked fish, man. Because give it a quick measurement. See what she is. Just under 20, 19 and a half. Awesome. Hey, that's a good one. That's a good one to start the trip. <clears throat> All right. She got a little sore on her lip, but I think she'll be fine. Of course. It's a tiger trip, man. They're strong as hell. Off she and goes. she doesn't take that long to take off. Nice. Man, those things are so <laughs> cool, man. So cool. <laughs> That's <laughs> awesome. That's pretty nice. That's a nice fish. That's a nice one? Nice one? Yeah. Speak to me, speak to me. Yeah, it's an extra one. It's probably the same size as the last time. It's got a little bit more tight. Yeah. yeah, for sure, for sure. Seems like the females are the ones with the more tight. Nice, you missed it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I almost... didn't leave it in the water. <laughs> there you go. Uh, we'll take it. Oh, nice shiny one. We'll take it. Another nice one. Nice. nice. One. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Tyler's number two for the day. Hoist her up. About the same size as the last one. What do you think? 19, 20? Yeah, probably a little bit smaller, I think. This has got really nice colors on it. Nice. Okay, give it a quick measurement, my man. Oh, so another one jumped over there Holy as that's happening. Okay, oh. hurry, hurry up, hurry up. Yeah. <laughs> 17. 17 inches. Okay. Off she goes. Tyler's got the net. Right, right. <laughs> what are you talking about? Trying to reel up. Oh, miss that one. <laughs> there you go, just like that. You missed it again. <laughs> oh, I don't reef on it. Finally! <laughs> thanks for, thanks for helping me with yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Thanks for helping me with that one. I appreciate that. Oh, yeah, buddy. Okay, yeah, buddy. They changed yo. Me and you are great net and fishing combo. Not really. I just have vi I have video proof of him missing it five times. <laughs> not, not great. All right, guys. Well, caught my second one now. Just op in the open water. More deeper. Well, yeah, it's not ice fishing, so I hope you catch in the open water. All right, you know what? Let's just get this guy back in. He's been uh, wind long enough. Oh yeah. Again, they have nice colors this uh, this weekend. Yeah, that's awesome. All right. Yeah, any other weekend, they're different colors. <laughs> <laughs> Two on the board. Let's. Oh, I didn't even measure it. <laughs> hey, how we feeling? How we feeling? It's a little chilly, but I mean, catching two fish earlier this morning was act actually it felt really good. Yeah, great start. You know, <laughs> <laughs> that's it. Uh, that's all. I just I'm gonna just stop now before I get too far. Ahead. Okay. Well, we're heading uh, into the shore right now, so I'm gonna steer us. <laughs> but uh, yeah, back on the water. Uh, gonna go try and catch some more fish. All right, folks. A little midday update. It's about one o'clock. We're back at the truck it is extremely windy so we're charging the battery thank you toyota for providing us with an outlet to charge the batteries because we got two but might as well charge the first one tyler z-rod he's uh making us some sandwiches these look delicious fantastic gonna show you what kind of our setup right trailer truck drinks food all in the coolers we got a big big tent here it was super cold last night so 
We have to uh, stay warm somehow. All right. All right, so then on inside, we got our cooler, full of the food for a few days, drinks, clothes, GoPro charging. Got to get those batteries. And then we slept just like this, just to keep the warmth together. We stacked them up on top of each other. Oh, Colton's here. So hey, guys, buddy. How's it going? Good, good, good. So uh, this just helps keep, <laughs> helps keep all the heat together in one area. So if you ever seen Step Brothers, you know exactly what this is about. We asked our parents we could do this. It was okay. So yeah, that's what's happening. You can hear the wind outside right now. It is, it's crazy. It's, it's not fun. So we're going to cook these sandwiches and then get back out on the water and catch some freaking fish. extremely windy out on the lake and every time we get out there we can only use trolling motors in this lake there's no gas motors so it's just sucking back batteries so we're gonna take a little break right now just had some lunch and I'm gonna introduce you guys quickly to the best game ever made this is called washer toss now the point of it is get this washer in here it's one point in here and three points in the center I'm gonna try to perform this for you guys really quick so washer is got to go in there just like this just like that. Now I get one point and the other person can cancel that out. So if you ever want to play me in this game, I challenge you, leave a comment below. 1v1 for a fishing lure, you, you and me. Suck. It's gonna be awesome. Okay, we're headed back out. Make sure the rods don't get all screwed up like how they are right now. Okay, yeah, not my rods. I don't really care, but that's fine. Okay, so we're out here, uh, Manitoba Fishing Adventures. Okay, give me that. Uh, my buddy here has a, a YouTube channel and uh, we're just gonna be out here fishing for tiger trout. My buddy Josh Maniaco, known as AKA Fishing Adventures. From Manitoba. From Manitoba. <laughs> he fishes out here in Manitoba, in the Manitoba Lake region. He'll fish for pike, walleye, trout, any kind of trout really. But at the end of the day, we're here and we're fishing he's, for tiger He's making trout. 14 bucks off the video, don't subscribe. <laughs> we're back on the water. We're gonna be out here till evening. Um, sun goes down to 8 p.m. Using little spoons, trolling right now to the spot because it is extremely, extremely windy still. So, yeah, using little spoons, little crankbaits, and we're gonna head out to this north side where it's not so windy and give it our best shot. I'm the only one that hasn't caught something yet, so hopefully I can get her done. And then tomorrow we still have a full day in case and then we have Sunday morning. So until then, stay tuned. Colton, anything to say? Um, you know what? I can't ask for much more. We've been uh, hitting them pretty good today. So if tomorrow is supposed to be 23, that's going to be a great day. It is supposed to be I think warm we're going to tomorrow. supposed to hit them tomorrow. And it's going to be amazing. Tyler? No. You good? You have to see. Sounds good. Also, buy the new Manto Fishing Adventures. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. That doesn't count. That doesn't count. He got one. He got one. That count. Count. That's good. That's good, baby. Show the camera. There it is. <laughs> yeah, baby. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, that is gonna wrap up day one out in Western Manitoba in the search of tiger trout. Two fish for Colton, two fish for Tyler, one for me. Tyler also lost two, got one that's broken off and one hit him right inside the boats. But overall, pretty crappy day weather-wise. It was pretty windy, um, but we had some fun. We set up base camp. We have a whole nother day tomorrow and then a uh, fish in the morning as well. So I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm pretty excited. Tyler's gonna enjoy his Skittles. We're probably gonna have a little bit of a fire. Relax, chill out, and enjoy some time off from work. If you guys are new here, make sure you click that subscribe button and stay tuned to part two of this Western Manitoba fishing adventure. Peace.